Hey guys, what's up? It's our Concepts here doing another commentary. And today I'm going to be talking about the Skype virus that has been going around everyone. And what it is, it is a keylogger, which means that once it affects your computer, it's able to take whatever it is you're typing and put it into a folder and basically send it to the person who created the virus. And everyone's getting it because once you get it, it sends a message to all your friends saying, LOL, is this your new profile picture? And then it gives a link to a broken Google with their username. And a lot of people don't know about this, so I just want to tell you guys, do not click that if you see it. And I recently had it because my mom did click it, which pissed me the hell off because I knew about it. But she was turning off my computer because she was mad at me. And so today I want to be teaching how to get rid of that. So first of all, you could go to Tools, then Options. And then after you go to options and then you go to advanced and then manage other programs access to Skype. And what will happen is there will be other programs right here that you probably haven't ever seen before or that you know about. So just delete them right away. And this just records my Skype calls and all that. So after that, just save. Another way to do this is you go to search for programs and files, percent, app, data, percent. You click enter and it brings up this right here. What this is, is all your recent files that you have. And what you will find is there will be files that look like this, just web files like that. And it will be usually a number, a letter or something, and another number, just like this one. And if you click on it, it does tell you the date it has been modified. So if you have any files like this uh, around the same time that you did get the virus just try to delete them right away and after you do that everything should be fine you just save restart your computer and you shouldn't have the virus anymore so uh thank you guys for watching my tutorial and i hope this has helped you out so please just spread the word to all your friends and see you guys